Maimon, and today I'm going to show you how to assemble a Pittsburgh brand two-ton folding engine crane right here. Uh, we bought it at Harbor Freight Tools, and we bought this uh, this two-ton instead of one-ton because in a video, uh, my dad didn't like how 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 long the boom and how wide the legs were spread. But you're going to see what those are in here. So there are two boxes. Uh, this one, one of two, is, uh, it shows it, it's uh, 50 pounds about, about. And here, two of two, is uh, about 130 pounds, or 60 kilograms. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Well, you can use scissors to cut it open, or you can peel this off without using any tools, as so. <laughs> right here, in box one, is the base, and in two, in two right here, is the main frame. And it looks like that the caster has already been uh, assembled, so, um, what we have, we're gonna have to do is to install this part. You're going to need a needle nose plier or a small hands to get under here. Let's get started. These are the tools needed to assemble the folding crane: the 24 millimeter wrench, a 22 millimeter wrench, which I also have here. Two of them, uh, and two, and I have. Two 14 millimeter wrenches, you only need one. Uh, an adjustable wrench, a screwdriver, a vice grip, a scissors, and needle you know, pliers, which I already mentioned. Duct tape, maybe, uh, even more pliers. And you can use these and sockets, uh, but these are extras if you don't have wrenches. So our first step is assembling the casters to the base. So there are two sets of casters, two large ones and two smalls. Uh, you're going to attach the large ones to right here. And you're going to attach the small ones, basically, right here. So what you're supposed to do is you're going to take these screws off, as I did right here. And you're going to take your small, your small uh, tester, and you're going to screw it in. It's gonna take a few tries to get it in. So we're gonna take the ratchet and we're going to tighten this using the old rule, ready to you lefty loosey. large caster is even harder than putting on a small caster. The reason is that uh, the adult's hand cannot fit under in this hole, so that when they use this, uh, they put this through, and, and they have to put their nuts, the, I mean the, the, let me get this, off. this and they have to put it in and screw it. It's not gonna fit. But there are three methods to resolve this. There is the obvious way. You can use your son or daughter, someone who has a small hand, to screw in the uh, nut for you. Or uh, you can use uh, the needle nose pliers and you can 
insert them here and then screw them and the other way is what I showed you before is the duct tape and you you put it where you want it you put the nut where you want it then tape it and then you screw it in uh, duct tape solves many problems So let's get to uh, attaching the large casters. <laughs>